As part of Laravel 8.70 and above, you can now chain a can method off of your route declarations. I'll show you a quick example. Here I've set up a route to edit a post. If we view it in Firefox, this is what you get, pretty standard stuff. But of course the problem is right now, anyone can access this page, when it should really be restricted to either administrators or at the very least, the author of the post. Okay, let's fix that. I'm gonna create a policy for a post. Make post post policy. All right, so that'll add a new policies directory to my app folder. And why don't we set up a ability to, let's keep it simple, to update a post. Now that's going to accept the current user as well as the post we're trying to update. And my logic is gonna be, if the author of the post is the current user, then you're good to go. Okay, return user is the author of the post. And just to be clear, I do have an author relationship that returns the corresponding user who wrote the post. Okay, so that's our policy, very simple. Now, in past versions of Laravel, we would reach for the can middleware, like this. Can, colon, then the ability name, which is update. And then if we have any arguments to pass to that method, we could do it like so. So in this case, post is mapping to what you see here. And then of course, that would be resolved out of the container to give you the actual post model that the user is trying to edit. Okay, so yeah, if I were to come back to Firefox, give it a refresh, sure enough, we get a 403, and that does the trick. So this is fine, you can stick with it, um, but I think it does, uh, I would admit, I think it does fall short of that Laravel silky smoothness that we sometimes expect. This can be a little confusing, a little easy to forget. So if you want, as of Laravel 8.70 and above, you can change this to can. Can we update the post? So it's just a little slight variation there, but I do think it reads that much better. So it's a nice PR by Taylor. And also it just sort of syncs things up a little better. For example, when you're in a blade view, you can use a can directive. They sync up. Or if you're working with an existing user, like auth user, you can call a can method on that model. So you see what I mean, how it just sort of syncs everything up to be that much more consistent. If I come back to Firefox, give it a refresh, we once again get our 403. But yeah, one of my favorite things about Laravel is how the team is constantly sort of interrogating the framework to find mm, what doesn't feel quite right, what feels a little off compared to the rest of the framework. And I think this is a really good example of that. It's a small but very nice improvement.